if you're new here, please make sure you subscribe because I am on the road to 150 subs and I make NBA content like this 2K and live every single day. Alright, so we are back with the Gerald Johnson My Career on NBA 2K19. And this video was supposed to be games 3 and 4, but sadly game 4 I wasn't actually recording. We ended up blowing them out by 50 and winning that game. And the Celtics also swept the Knicks and made it to the finals. Hall of Fame verification right there. We're going into game 3 in this one. And I already told you game i'm um, giving jimmy butler and lebron 42 minutes game four we ended up blowing them out by 50 two major things happened in that game and before i get into it make sure you guys are subscribed if you are new here because i make nba content like this every single day and we are on the road to 150 subs we have 115 right now only a couple more only what 35 more and we can do it so be sure you subscribe and like this video if you enjoyed now as you see the highlights of game three in the background um, I'm going to explain what exactly happened in Game 4. So we ended up blowing the blowing the Rockets out. We won by 50. I dropped 63 points, something like that, with 6 blocks. And two major things happened. Not to us, to the Rockets. So going into this series, when they tied it up, I'm like, oh boy, this is going to go to like 7 games. 6 if we're lucky. And then, you know, Game game 5 happened. Not Game, was it? No, it was Game 4, not 5. Game um, 4 happened, and... Right in the beginning of the game, um, as you see, Bogdan's on the team. Bogdan goes down with a strained Achilles. He's out for the season. It was a strained Achilles or strained MCL. It was one of those, but he's out for the rest of the series. Then, at the end of the game, I'm going down court. All of a sudden, I see Chris Paul limping. I'm like, oh boy. Okay, I scored, hit a post fade. Chris Paul's down. He, he's got a hard Achilles too. He's out for the rest of the season. So the Rockets are effed. They're, they're not. We are most likely going to close this series out. Yes, I just spoiled it. We do win this game. It starts off close. Then the third quarter happens. But we can most likely close this game out in five games. This series out. Because all they have is James Harden now. As I block him in the paint. All they have is James Harden. Chris Paul's down. Who was arguably their best player. Jesus Christ, LeBron. Holy crap, dude. He had a triple-double in this game. So, it's only James Harden left. Chris Paul was arguably their best player in the series as a fleet. And the third best, the fourth best player, and Bogdan, is out too. So, all they have is Harden and Capella now. They're effed. They're effed because we don't have any injuries, knock on wood. And we got a very healthy Celtics team in the finals who just swept. So, if we don't close this game out in five, and we have to go to a game six or possibly game seven... It's not going to look good because the Celtics are waiting. They swept the Knicks. They're waiting. They have not lost at all in these playoffs. They have won 12 straight games. Unbelievable. Unbelievable that that team is still as good as it is while I'm gone. But as you see, I'm hitting the three. Let's get into this actual game three. As the series is tied one to one, we're starting to take over as Kuzma. Throwing it down. We're up by eight. We started to take over in this game late second quarter and the whole third quarter as you see we're up by 13 to start off the third and this is where stuff got we just start blowing them out of the water well i can't really say blowing out we went out up going up by 10 i think by the end of the third quarter as i'm hitting the green release hitting chris paul with a little shimmy he's shooting four for ten i was locking him down in the first half then the second half he started going off he just was a madman in the second half harden did not have a good game shooting from three at all he had a very bad game shooting from three as I'm pulling up for the three. Green, Bean, Chris Paul ain't guarding me. He was not guarding me at that moment. But as you see, we are up by 20 and I'm getting the end one. Going to the line looking for 60. My first 60 point performance in these playoffs. I'm pretty sure getting that to go. Also in game um, four, I did have, like I said, 63 points. So that is a combined of, hold up, let me hit this green release disrespectful. I, if I'm correct, I think I just scored 63 to 65. That's a bind of 128 points in back-to-back -back games. Also, both games I had six blocks. As we do take game three of the series, going up two games, 2-1, two, defeating the Rockets by 21. There's your other Hall of Fame difficulty check. Obviously, I'm playing on Hall of Fame now. I'm not playing on Superstar. If we were playing on Superstar, I'd be beating this team by like 70. 
But um, that's that, but I'm surprised we actually won that game by as much as we did. So LeBron had a triple double. Butler with 20 points was so actually helped out very, very well. Mo Wagner also had a good game. Harden with 30 shot terrible from three. Chris Paul with 27 points. So that's gonna be for me. If you like if you guys enjoyed, subscribe if you're new. Subscribe, subscribe, and that is it for me. That's the GG.